So for today's video, I'm going to be reacting to the trailer for a movie called The Farm. I saw this posted on Nightmare on Film Street's website. If you guys have not listened to their podcast, I highly, highly suggest it. They're awesome people. Um, they also have a Facebook group that you can join. Um, I will leave a link to the article about the trailer down below, as well as the link to the Facebook page. Um, I and yeah, they're on Twitter and all of that. They're just highly, highly suggest them uh, to very lovely people. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and just jump into this. As usual, I haven't read much about it. I did read a little paragraph from uh, Nightmare on Film Street's website where they said, Judging from the synopsis and the look of the trailer, comparisons will undoubtedly be made to the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. But I'm keeping my fingers crossed that the farm is able to offer something new to the genre. Um, so, looking from the pictures that they did post on the article, I can definitely see that. Um, so, we will go ahead, though, and just see for ourselves. Wouldn't it be much nicer to stay at home? Yes, it job. would. I'm tired and I don't want to get us into an accident, okay? No, I know. going on here? You don't want to know. How do we get out of here? You don't. Okay, so I can definitely see where the comparisons um, for Texas Chainsaw Massacre come from, but that definitely looks like it is going to be so much harder to stomach. I, holy Moses. Um, so I've mentioned on my channel before, not that big of a fan of Texas uh, franchise. It's okay. Uh, but that looks way more fucked up. Because uh, in Texas, it's like implied. You know they're eating people. They kind of show some stuff. But this just goes full on. We are showing them eating people. Ugh. No. Gross. Um, <laughs> it's actually kind of funny. Um, as a vegan... For some odd reason, the conversation of cannibalism is often something that I'm asked about. Like, oh, you know, if you were trapped on an island and you had to eat an animal or a person. And it's actually uh, ended up having sort of a conversation about that uh, on the live stream that Vicky from Nightmare Raven and Emma from Spooky Astronauts uh, did because they were reviewing... Uh, for those of you who don't know, they have a new once a month live stream um, called Does This Offend You? where they talk about different movies that are often viewed as being offensive. Um, they For their first episode, uh, which I will link in the description below, please go check it out. It is awesome and absolutely fantastic. Um, and make sure you're subscribed to both of those wonderful ladies. Um, but... Anyway, whole thing, you can 
go watch Vicky talk about that um, <laughs> in there. So, yeah, uh, for whatever reason, people always want to, like, ask me that as if, like, I'm going to choose to eat people. Anyway, but that, yeah, that looks so intense. I don't even know if that's something that I could get through, uh, but I will probably definitely try that. I don't know as though it's something I'm going to necessarily want to see in theaters that may be me that may need to be a at home DVD trying to stomach it by myself <laughs> type film. Uh, but let me know what you guys thought about it in the comments below. Does it look as uh, intense as I feel like it's going to be? Um, is it something that you want to see or do you feel like, oh, just another Texas Chainsaw Massacre copy? Um, let me know. So if you guys did like this reaction video, please do give it a big old thumbs up and make sure to hit that subscribe button for more horror related content. And I'll be back later with another video. <laughs> Bye.